There's something about improvisation that is immediately disarming. You're listening differently to people, and then you start by having a dialogue. Um, somebody moves their body in a certain way, and you respond, and it triggers you to try to show something that you do. And without thinking so much, um, whereas performance is, is more of something contrived, where we spend a lot of time trying to make it just right. Um, so it's very important for us to reveal ourselves through improvisation, and this is why we began with that at Jacob's Pillow, to get beyond the words. So this is the main basic thing that we're going to do all the time on stage. What has always fascinated me about this endeavor is the fact that artists are attracted to borders. There's a certain uh, magnetic field around the border. You know, otherness is fascinating to artists. Um, so what is this thing about the border, this line between that makes people both attracted and, you know, they're attracted to them and also repulsed by them at the same time. There's violence there and there's also a great potential. I mean, the very first thing that happened was in 2016, this whole border thing blew up where people were coming on, as they still are, coming on boats. One of the first points of contact with the European Union was the island of Lesbos in Greece. So I said, look, this is about borders. We have to go there. And we went and um, the concept was pretty simple. We just brought a bunch of musical instruments, brought drums and ouds. And the idea was simply, let's just set up in a corner of the refugee camps and play. And what we discovered is that whoever was holding the drum was the center of gravity for these little, these little global hoot nannies, we can call it, these little jam sessions. So that's where it all began. 